there's something odd in the air at Woburn Abbey, stately home of the Duke of Bedford, and this time it happens to be old furniture. It's a competition sponsored by the furniture and bedding manufacturers with a prize for the most original means of transport. Another lighter-than-air merchant came by bike. Others were rocked in the cradle of the deep. The Duke and Duchess of Bedford acted as judges. A thousand pounds was waiting for the most unusual transport, while there was 500 pounds for the ugliest piece of furniture. Obviously more than potty, round the bend in fact. <coughs> Brian Dunlop pushed an antique seed drill and a Victorian table for 75 miles. But no one beat the 25 schoolboys from Leighton Buzzard. Dressed as ancient Britons, they pushed their desks along on rollers, the way the stones were taken to Stonehenge. They donated half their thousand pound prize to the Aberfan Disaster Fund. There was some really ludicrous old lumber, some shocking old sideboards, but the biggest carve up was contributed by the Duke. Roast venison at a bob a portion, all proceeds to charity. Later that evening, they roasted the furniture. The slogan of the furniture industry is, old furniture must go. Mrs. Hyde went at Woburn, a giant bonfire of horrible heirlooms from worm-eaten walnut to mutilated mahogany.